So today I'm going to be showing you the V60 filter technique. So to do that we need the V60, the filter paper and a kettle. So to start with we're going to wet the filter paper. We do that for two reasons. A to keep the filter paper in the V60 and to help clean the filter paper. So you need a small amount to hold it in there. Once that's drained through, empty the excess water. So we're going to be using a ratio of 1 to 15. So that means 1 gram of coffee to 15 ml of water. This does depend on personal preference and what coffee you're using. So I'm going to be using 20 gram of coffee and we'll be getting 300 ml of water out. So we're using a Wilfer electronic grinder and you can see it's on the filter setting here. So with my scoop, I'm going to be putting 20 gram of coffee in here. So once we've got the coffee in the V60, in a circular motion, we are going to cover the coffee with the water. So where you can see these bubbles come into the surface, this is what we call blooming. This is when the coffee is heated and it releases carbon dioxide. We let this bloom for 20 seconds. Once the coffee is bloomed, we then pour more water in a circular motion onto the coffee. Until you have the right amount of coffee. Once you let that drain through, take the V60 off, empty the filter, paper with the coffee in and you're free to drink.